Okay, so let's talk about some of the things I don't like about the Google Pixel 6, right? And this is basic software, right? I don't like the Google launcher, the Google Pixel launcher on here, the home screen launcher, I don't like it. I don't like the Google search bar at the bottom of my screen. It looked like, looked like wasted space to me, right? I want my apps here at the bottom uh, and I like to customize my device. And you can't do it here because I can't remove the search bar and I can't remove the weather app. So if you try to remove the weather app, you can't do it and you can't remove the Google search. So what I'm gonna do is I'm definitely gonna install Nova Launcher on this device so I can get complete customization. What's up everybody, this is like the Tech Preacher. So you got your Pixel 6 and Pixel 6 Pro and you're a little ticked off because there's no customization with your home screen. You have a search bar that you can't move. You got all kinds of things that you can't do. Well, I might have a solution for you. Also, if you are a Galaxy Note user and you went to a Pixel and you want to get some type of pin support and some type of pin software, again, I may have a solution for you. So let's talk about these two things in this video. So sit back and relax and get your popcorn ready and follow me on this journey. Let's go. Okay, so let's talk about Nova Launcher. Nova Launcher gives you full control of every aspect of the look and feel of your device. Once you download it from the Google Play Store, which I will leave that link down in the description below, you go into your settings and you at the top, you go to your search menu and type home to and go to the default home app and then click on Nova 7 and voila, you are greeted to a new home screen uh, with no search bar and no weather app. Now let's get to work making your pixel the way you want. If you hold down and press the home screen, you will be greeted to wallpapers and settings. Once you click on settings, now you are greeted to Nova 7, where you can change everything from your home screen grid to your icon layout, to the look and feel, to look and inputs. You can make a lot of changes. Don't worry about speed because this launcher makes your pixel even faster, in my opinion. So this is the way to go if you don't like the pixel launcher. The second thing for my Note users, if you leave in the Galaxy Note series or you leave in the Galaxy S21 Ultra that had pin support, you're kind of missing some of that, uh, that pin goodness, right? Well, guess what? I got this under $20 pin. I will leave this link down in the description below. It has a pointy tip, right? And I'm kind of give you some reference. This is the Note pin. This also has a pointy tip, but this tip is a lot more pointier than the Galaxy Note. So you could get that good position uh, layout here. All right, this pin will work with any Android or iOS device, right? So this pin works very well with no latency at all. Now it doesn't have poem rejection. Again, these are not notes, but this works very well. This say if you want to do a note and I would advise you to download OneNote. Microsoft One, OneNote is very good, right? In this instance, you could do all kinds of things and then kind of give an example here. So at this point I can write, right? Put this down, right? And again, no palm rejection. So you got to, you know, put your hand away. This, the uh, pixel. There you go, six. So it works very well, as you can see. Or you could put grid lines, you could put rule lines and stuff like that, and you could do it like that. And uh, it works very well. So one of the things that uh, I like about OneNote is that uh, not only you can use the pen and pen support, it's it has very good integration, right, across devices. Uh, one of the things that I do like is that you can add all kinds of different things here. This say, for instance, I want to add a photo, right? So I, if I want to add a photo, add this photo here. Mm -hmm. All right. Uh, this may hit the uh, crop, and I'm going to just crop this a little bit. 
right there. I'm using the pin for that. Look how good it look, right? I'm gonna confirm, done. All right, so as you can see, I just inserted a photo uh, into OneNote and now I can use the pin. I can do annotations and all kinds of things like that. I can say, you know, I like that right there. I'll circle that right here. And could, I could do this right here and I can say, this is nice. There it is, right? So I could do all of that. I could circle it. I could do anything that I need uh, with the pen and using OneNote. I think this is the best app if you want to utilize a pen on your Pixel device or any Android device uh, with that said. So uh, definitely this pen comes in handy. Yes, it's big, it's bulky. You got to carry it. It's something extra. Of course, it's not a Galaxy Note. So it's something, yes, you have to carry that's extra. Yes, it's very good if you want to write down notes and you want to insert photos and do all kinds of different things so this works very well if you are sick and tired of the pixel launcher on your pixel device go ahead on and download nova Launcher. i will leave that link down in the description below and go ahead on and make your pixel 6 customizable baby this is eric the tech preacher from easy computer solutions leave your comments down below let me know what you think about nova launcher and pin and plus one note Go ahead and download those apps. It works great with this pen. Go ahead and have fun with it. This is Eric. See you guys on the next video. Peace.